<laughs> you going to jail tonight, boy. All right, YouTube, what's up, it's Magnus. Today we're installing the strobe lights in the grill of Scourge. We're just gonna take the grill off and we're gonna install, there are four of them, on the actual header panel behind the grill. You'll be able to see the light shine through that Harley Davidson grill. As you know, Scourge is my recovery vehicle. I have to go pretty much anywhere and everywhere with this thing. I uh, did a video on the tires you can check that out if you want. I'll put a card up for it. But the kit I got, it's a kit from Amazon. And I've been looking at it, been doing some research on it. It got some really good reviews. And for the price, you couldn't beat it. Uh, it gives you two ways of powering the lights. You got a control box here. You got your four lights. And they give you a lot of cable length which I don't even think I'm gonna need this much from where I'm going from just the grill to the inside of the cab. They give you a direct wire if you wanna hardwire the lights through the control box. But I'm gonna use the cigarette lighter adapter that they provide. It looks a little more simple. I can just unplug it when I'm not using them. Uh, just has a its own power switch that you use to turn the lights on and off and this button right here you press it it's got like eight different modes i believe to uh for the lights to sequence this is your control box we're gonna find somewhere to mount that it's pretty straightforward it's gonna take longer to run the wires than actually hook the thing up so we're gonna get started gonna start out by taking the grill off the scourge and we'll go from there. They've got gasket maker where the wire enters into the back of the light, but I just put more RTV around it just to give it a better seal. I'm letting it dry here. Now we're gonna go up front and mark our holes for where we're gonna mount these things. Okay, this is how we're gonna mount them. Like I said before, we're gonna do it on the header panel, put one in each corner. I had to use the drill bit, drill a hole large enough, just kind of wall it out so the connector can pass through like that. And then we're gonna hide the wires through there, through here, through your existing wire loom. We're gonna attach it, zip tie to that. And we're gonna pass it through the firewall and we're gonna mount the control box inside the cab up under the dash. Okay, we got all four lights installed. We got our wires head going down, coming to the bottom and up. Got a loom over the wires. We got them passing through the header panel here through this existing hole for our wiring. And then we're gonna pass them back into the firewall in this corner back here. Okay, we got our lights through the firewall. We gotta put our plug back in. Now we got to just mount the control box that's pretty much it find a place to mount our switch somewhere in here and uh that's really all there is to it we're going to go and get these tidied up get everything plugged in and try them out see how they look here's the box remember and like i said the middle is for your power supply we're going to be using the cigarette lighter adapter like i said we're going to find somewhere to mount our switch. It says to mount the box somewhere away from direct heat and good ventilation. So it's probably not a good idea to mount it in the engine bay. So that's why we ran the wires through the firewall and we're gonna mount it here up under the dash uh, out, out of the engine bay, keep it inside, keep it moisture from getting into it too. Uh, so it'll be inside the cab. Yeah, I know guys, my floor is dirty as shit and I gotta vacuum it out. Don't hold that against me, but here we are. Here's our the control switch box. It's mounted, got it mounted up. Got the wires tucked away. We got the control switch mounted on the dash beside the gang rocker switches. Still gotta do something about 
hiding this just goes to the power port been playing with the modes and they look good man very nice can't beat it 40 bucks on amazon it's got eight different modes i've been playing with them this is like mode hell i don't know five or six something like that but uh i'll put a link in the description for you guys can't go wrong if you need some strobe lights on your truck like i said this is my recovery truck personal truck uh so just want to make me look more official when i'm going out on the job but i've been magnus enjoy the rest of your day i'll holler at you catch you next one peace